Okay, so I've been wanting to do this for a while, um, which is get a video on feeding time. Um, as you guys can see, I got a few more fish in here. Um, it's looking real lively. A um, little bit more on that later. Here, let me uh, put this down for a second. I'm going to go ahead and feed them. Feeding time. I don't know how well you can see everybody. So everybody's over here. So, all right, let's go down the checklist. Um, I got two guys in here that I'm housing that um, I'm probably gonna bring back tomorrow. One of them went into hiding. Um, oh no, they're there. There's the two tiger oscars the little babies um I'm bringing them back tomorrow um also interesting is this peacock here this ob peacock um she's been chasing around my little lemon pepper dude um i got them from the same tank from the pet shop and um she noticed him right away and has been chasing him i think they were paired up so dude back there is mad now because he had paired up with her um you know also, let's see, I think I got the two uh, Rodices in there. I got two Electric Blues in here. Um, I think that's one. I think that's the Zebra. Also, I got a red or orange Zebra. What else did I get? I got another fish in here that my mom wanted. She's like, oh, I like it. It looks like a tiger. Uh, I forgot what it's called. I'll figure it out again tomorrow. Where'd he go? down there he's down there in the back um can't really get a good picture of him but yeah and uh, of course got the jack dempsey um the little blue zebra blue dolphin still doing good he's gotten a little bit bigger yeah everybody's doing good um I found out what happened to my albino cichlid. He had got sucked underneath um, the volcano when I had a different when I had the whisper hooked up to it. But I went ahead and put the stock one back on there, and then I got the little bubble wall. But I got a 48 inch uh, flexible wand and my 60, my 20 to 60. I think it's a whisper or accu something um, that came in in the mail today. So I'm gonna hook that up and put a bubble wall. All the way across the back. Mr. Placo came out. Yeah, even that guy's doing pretty good. Um, that's his little spot down there. But he comes out and about with everybody. Yeah, and everybody's good. I mean, I keep hearing from everybody. No, you can't mix this. You can't mix that. Everybody seems to be doing really good. Um, the most aggressive out of everybody, I'm telling you right now, and it's the weirdest thing, is these fucking peacocks. Peacock's supposed to be the most docile. Um... She's kind of aggressive to a point. The guy's really aggressive. Um, and he's always chilling back there. You know, he's a little asshole. But, you know, other than that, everybody else is cool. You know? Now, what I'm thinking is, um, they're supposed to be live bearers. So, I don't know. He's been, he's been guarding that area back there pretty good. I, I doubt they laid eggs since they're live bearers, but... You know, I don't know. Could be there could be somebody mixed with somebody else. I don't know. And this little dude's always greedy. He always grabs a big ass pellet and just sucks on it. So yeah, my little electric yellows are growing. They're getting big. Everybody's doing really good. Everybody's pretty happy. Um, got a bunch of babies in here now. Some of the babies are more grown. Uh, it's a lot there on the bottom. Yeah, I had to thin them out. Uh, guppies didn't last long in this tank. Uh, I got to do a water change tomorrow. See, I haven't... Their, their poop and stuff hasn't been, like, all in the same areas. I know the flow of water has changed because of um, the bubbles and the different rocks and stuff in there. 
so I haven't been able to find their poop, but I'm going to do a clean tomorrow. My nitrates were up a little bit, you know, I think. I got a lot of fish in here now, so, um, yeah, it's a bit crowded right now. And, you know, it's opposite of what I keep hearing. I keep hearing with cichlids, oh, you got to overcrowd it, so there's less aggressiveness. The, when I had a little bit of cichlids in here, they were not that aggressive. Now that I got more in here, there's more aggressiveness going on. Um, I just wanted to point that out, you know. Um, but I am looking into a 120-gallon tank, maybe bigger, I don't know. Um, and I got a couple lined up for pretty cheap. So, we'll see how that goes. But for now, um, I'm just going to house these guys in here for a little bit. So, yeah, stay tuned for next update. Uh, probably going to be next week or so. All right, stay tuned.